so that was all right. Um, it was nice to get the car up on the lift and check out everything. Uh, there's some good, there's some bad. Uh, the good is that the subframe seemed to be all right. Um, didn't see any cracks under there, so I think everything's good there. That's why I bought a 2005, because they were less prone to the subframe cracks. The other good news is the CSL bumper, the vent on the CSL bumper, is routed to the airbox. So that's pretty cool, um, getting more airflow to the engine. Um, and one last thing I have to take care of myself. Uh, the bad things, the underside was scratched up, probably from this car just being so low. Um, there were some guards missing, some just parts that will probably need to be replaced. Not a huge deal or not, not an urgent matter, but something I want to look into. The main thing that I found that I'm going to have to fix is the driver's side rear axle. Uh, where it connects to the differential there's a rubber boot there and it's torn and it's slinging grease everywhere and probably letting some dirt in which could ruin that part so um, i will go inside right now order a new part and we will get that fixed in an upcoming episode but overall just happy to get the car in the air see what's going on underneath and i guess just really know what i'm in for so um thank you guys for watching Give it a thumbs up if you like this episode. Please subscribe so you can see I mean, where we take this car and what happens on my journey to be the best driver I know. Thanks again, and we'll see you guys soon.